Marie Van Britten Brown was born October 30, 1922 in Jamaica, Queens, New York. Her father was born in Massachusetts and her mother from Pennsylvania. Marie Van Britten Brown, attended school in Jamaica, Queens, New York and started off her career working as a nurse. Her husband Albert was an electronic technician, the couple had two children. As a nurse Brown worked long hours and would return home late at night. Her husband too had irregular hours, so she was often alone at night. The crime rate in her neighborhood had increased and the police response time in the area was so slow to emergency calls, Brown taught of ways to feel safer. Marie Van Brown with the assistance of her husband began devising a home security system. Brown's invention was comprised of peepholes, a camera, monitors and a two-way microphone and the final element was an alarm button that could be pressed to contact the police or security. Three peepholes were placed on the front door at different height levels. The top one was for tall persons, the middle one was for a person of average height. The bottom one was for children. At the opposite side of the door a camera was attached with the ability to slide up and down to allow the person to see through each peephole. The camera picked up images that would reflect on the monitor via a wireless system. The monitor could be placed in any part of the house to allow one to see who was at the door. There was a voice component to enable the homeowner to speak to the person outside, if the person was perceived to be an intruder, the police or security would be notified with the push of a button. If the person was a welcome visitor, the door could be unlocked via a remote control. Marie and Albert Brown filed for a patent for home security and were approved December, 2, 1969. Marie Van Brown's closed-circuit television home security system was so effective and innovative that she received an award from the National Science Committee and recognition in the New York Times. Unfortunately Marie Van Brown and her husband Albert Brown never benefited financially from their invention. As a woman, let alone an African-American woman, it was very difficult to sell her invention. Sadly Marie Van Brown died in 1999 at the age of 76 in Queens, New York and never saw her vision realized, but laid the foundation for modern day security systems. Marie Van Brown and her husband's legacy lives on. Over 40 years later the technology is in use today, at the airports, banks, department stores, grocery stores, apartment complex, and around the world. Today home security is a multi-billion dollar industry and is expected to triple.